Now, despite having its worst year of power cuts in 2023, South Africans are bracing for another double-digit ESCOM tariff increase this year. ESCOM's more than 12% electricity price increase for the 2024-25 financial year started today for ESCOM direct customers. Let's discuss this now further with former executive manager of ESCOM and energy expert Vali Padayachi. Thank you very much, Mr. Padayachi, for coming into studio. Good evening uh, and uh, happy Easter, Anne to you and the viewers. Thank Whatever you is left of it, well. but <laughs> I'm so, glad to be back, yes. South African consumers are having a tough time at the moment. Um, We've got possible imminent fuel price hikes looming next week. Uh, this week we're dealing with uh, energy tariff increases, but this is not a new thing. It's been coming for a while now. Uh, NOSA approved these tariff increases a while ago. Last year, um, South Africans absorbed the bulk of that 33% increase at uh, more than 18%. This year, the remaining 12 plus percent needs to be absorbed. Um, and for ESCOM Direct customers, the 1st of April is D-Day. That's today. Um, but the date given for municipalities for those tariff increases is the 1st of July. Does that effectively mean that South Africans paying municipalities directly for their energy get a bit of a two-month reprieve? Not really. The, uh, that, that two months is, uh, is caught up in some way. And uh, so maybe this suffice to say... Uh, there's no reprieve. It is caught up in some way, okay. and there is some detail for that. Uh, so whether you're paying ESCOM direct or whether you're paying yeah. a municipality, you're going to be hit by these increases yes. eventually. Now, in the reports of these tariff increases, there's a mention of something called the affordability subsidy charge, and that's listed at 25.24%, which, which you know, seems quite scary. What is it? How does it work? Where is it factored into? 